we are coming to the USA for the Arsenal tour. From the 17th of July to the 27th of July. Washington. In New York. LA. I'm looking forward to getting a tan. We can't wait to meet all you Arsenal fans. So stay locked in. Let's go. Oh, I've, I've got it. I know what I'm going to say. Looking forward to coming to the US to watch the champions elect. That'll be Arsenal. Arsenal are going on tour and we're going to be there too. Washington DC, New York and Los Angeles. I cannot wait. This video is a little breakdown of what you can expect from the Arsenal side of things, the AFTV side of things. And if you're a fan that's out there too, or you just want to be kept up to date with what's going on on the tour, we're going to let you know what's happening here. And of course, we'll be vlogging all of it, all 10 days out in the States. I absolutely cannot wait. Let's go into it because there's going to be a lot of note looking because there's a lot going on and I don't want to miss a single thing. Let me tell you all about it. First of all, as I mentioned, we will be flying into Washington DC on the Monday. I cannot wait. I've never been. I bet it's going to be amazing. I'm sure we'll be doing lots of footage outside the uh, White House and all the other places that you've got to see. We'll touch on that in a little bit more. Let me just tell you about why we're in Washington DC. It is the MLS All-Stars game, 8.30pm local time at the Aldi Field Stadium on the Wednesday. So we are arriving a couple of days before because there's plenty going on in the time for that. In the MLS All-Stars game, a couple of players you'll recognise. Ben Teke, Carlos Hill, who I believe, did he play for Villa? I might be wrong. Ricky Puig, who I think was at Barcelona as well. Thiago Almada, Almada the play football manager, you'll know. Uh, and the manager, Wayne Rooney of the MLS All-Stars. And there is, of course, a skills challenge going on where you'll be able to see some of your favourite players, like some Martin Erdegaard, new signing Kai Havertz, Balogun's going to be there, Ramsdale. Who doesn't want to see them take part in the skills challenge? More on the Arsenal website if you want to read about what they'll be doing. But it's various crossbar challenges, penalties, this, that and the other. And there's lots going on in terms of fan events as well. On the Monday, a block party at Lou City Bar from 6pm. More details, by the way, will be in the link in the description below. Gunas V Council website as well, with a lot of these details. Again, all in the description below. Um, there will be a pre-skills challenge party at Duke's Grocery Navy Yard and a Mission Navy Yard event, uh, Arsenal event, in the afternoon, before and after the skills challenge. As I mentioned, the skills challenge is taking place on that Tuesday night. And then on the Wednesday, the bullpen uh, will be hosting a match day party for a 6.30 p.m. local time walk or march shall I say to the stadium for the match as I said the Audi Field Stadium hosting that like I mentioned AFTV will be going to lots of different venues we will be and locations we will be filming previews content we'll be doing fan cams the lot we will be there vlogging it all so go meet us out there if you are there as well okay then we head to New York I cannot wait I went about 15 years ago I haven't been since I can't wait to go back again now the game is actually in New Jersey at the MetLife Stadium 5 p.m. kickoff local time and that is on the Saturday guess who else will be out there that is right the United View will be out there we're going to meet up with Flex and is KG there I think KG's there uh, and anyone we can see as well meet some United fans banter them a bit I guess we can do it before it gets really serious in August but listen this is going to be an important match as well Ten Hag will likely go strong Arteta will too and it's a really really good test I think the first test in pre-season where we actually start to see how ready Arsenal might be now on the Thursday there's a Gunas versus Cancer charity weekend kickoff um, with, at the Old City Cheesesteaks and Brew uh, hosted it's an Arsenal event hosted by Gunas v Cancer along with Arsenal NYC and that starts at 6pm on the Thursday and the Friday will be at the Torch and Crown Brewery for the supporters party from 8 p.m. as well. And there are several after parties going on as well throughout Friday, Saturday, everything going on. So do go check out all the various things. Again, I'm putting them in the description below. The various handles you should follow for all the groups that are organizing lots of stuff. Arsenal America are hosting a lot of it or a, bit a part of the scheduling and planning for a lot of it. So do go and check out all this if you want more information. Uh, and as I mentioned, we will de we'll be doing content, some with the United View, some bespoke here on AFTV as always, and festival. I'm sure we'll be running around Times Square asking the fans, as he always does, what they're making of signings, players, results, pre-season, whatever it might be, because this is a massive pre-season for Arsenal. Now, admittedly, we haven't got as much information as I'd like in terms of Los Angeles. There's still a few things being ironed out and tweaked here and there, but when we know, we will absolutely let you know as well. We'll be covering it all, and we'll make sure to let you know on AFT what we'll be doing and where we'll be. Uh, but we are speaking at an event at the Fox and Hounds on the Sunday, the 23rd. That is the day that we arrive in LA. Uh, we'll be on a panel with Sophie from Highbury Squad, Mike from Gunas V Cancer as well and a few of us from AFTV will be speaking. I cannot wait. It's always great to chat 
So the live at Arsenal will take lots of questions, answers, meet the fans, get everyone's thoughts. We'll be doing content across LA as well because we're there a day longer from Sunday through to the Wednesday when the game actually is against Barcelona and it's at no other place than the SoFi Stadium. That is the home of the LA Rams. That is the big, big stadium that was built by the Cronkies. State-of-the-art stuff. And it is... um, yeah, it's going to be unbelievable. Hopefully, we'll be able to meet a few, I don't know, maybe meet a few players, maybe ask Arteta a question. Cecil managed it last year. We'll try it again. Uh, but that will be absolutely incredible to do as well. And there'll be plenty of events going on. Now, as I mentioned, the supporters groups that you need to follow will be in the link in the description below. All the handles will be there. Go check out for any information you want on any of the events that are going on. We haven't covered everything that's going on in this video. It's just some of it. So you've got a little bit of an idea of what to expect. Um, and go check out the Gunas versus Cancer page as well the link is in the description below big up to mike who's played a big part in organizing a lot of this and is always at the heart of some of the best arsenal content so go check out all that as well and of course with gunas versus cancer he is you know doing an amazing thing and go support that as well uh, and also if you're at ny if you are in nyc arsenal nyc new york city um have various locations where you can meet for the game and the link is in the description below and more details for that as well right we've covered as much as we can there of the tour we will be keeping you up to date via our vlogs and everything else that is happening on AFTV. i cannot wait to be there i can't wait to meet all of you that will be too um and we hope all you just enjoy all the content that will be coming out from the tour many many thanks see you in america we are coming to the usa for the arsenal tour from the 17th of july to the 27th of july washington in new york la i'm looking forward to getting a tan we can't wait to meet all you arsenal fans so stay locked in let's go oh, I've, I've got it i've got no what to say looking forward to coming to the us to watch the champions elect that'll be arsenal Welcome back to the Forever Arsenal podcast. Black, white, young, old, you know, knees on there, you know, disabled, abled, man, well, it doesn't. Smith Rowe didn't get a minute yesterday, not a minute that needs minutes. Where's he going to get his minutes from now? Get your, the, get your notifications on, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Tactical <laughs> chat tomorrow. <laughs> I think the idea of Mesut Ozil was, was, was better than the actual reality of Ozil at Arsenal. For the, your mic, not turn your camera on. For the audio listeners, uh, Lee's yeah. Lee, Lee, yeah. in pieces. Lee's in pieces. I have it. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat, and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.